everybody, welcome back to another episode of Night Witches. So, I've got uh, most of the mechs repaired here. I did have a build for the Orion. I kind of just, I don't know, if, I don't know, don't want to want to don't want to say winged it, but I had a couple of thoughts on it, so I just kind of built something and I'll show you that after uh, once it gets repaired. Um Actually, let's just talk about it now. I, I put it a, a pair of um, extended uh, ER pulse lasers, one on each arm, uh, a pair of Clan LRM 15s in the left torso, and in the right torso, I put an Ultra Auto Cannon 2. Um, we got a, um, uh, what do you call it? Um, prototype double heatsink kit in with all the prototype double heatsinks and stuff, just to bring the heat down. It is pretty hot. There's an exchanger in there and everything. Um, uh, also, um, the. Uh, what do you want to call it? The the uh, uh, heat dissipating armor and um, yeah, I think that's about it. I think we also got a clan TTS weapons in there, so it gives plus two for all the weapons chance to hit. So it should be, you know, relatively an accurate mech. It's mostly a splash damage mech, so we'll see how that runs. All right, but right now we're gonna jump in straight into some contracts here. So let's have a look at what we got. We've got two here that I want to do today. We've got biological sample. And we've got a war criminal. And I think what we'll do, oh, my cat's come to visit me. I think what we'll do is we're going to hit up um, war criminal mm, second. And we're going to do biological sample first. I don't want to lose our liked status right now. How are we here? 65. I don't think we'll lose our liked status. Let's, let's do war criminal first. That's going to be our main lance. So let's negotiate this. And we're going to go full salvage and see, see what we can get out of this. Um, so, Baby Yaga, Sunflower, Cataphract, Archer. Uh, what do we want to run here? Um, Zed? Uh, I don't think this is going to be a... Well, it might be a difficult mission. Um, there's my cat. Uh, do we want to run the Defiance? I think, probably. Let's give that to Sunflower. Um, just got to remember all our builds here. Oh, yeah, we got the Flamehawk. Um, our um, Black Knight still needs to be rebuilt. I haven't had a chance to go ahead and do that. We'll do that after this mission, but it definitely need, needs to be rebuilt. So uh, we can't really run that today. Um, but we are kind of stealing Satori and Sound Sonic from the other lances. So let's uh, leave them out. Let's bring Hot Dam in and let's bring in. Uh, I know they're not the best pilots for this, but where are you here, Megasaur? Um, I'll let you run the Archer and I think Hot Dam and the Cataphract. We got the PPCs and the Ultra 5 on this guy. And then, of course, our Archer with the uh, LRM-20 loadout. So, yeah, let's run this way. We'll see how it goes. I mean, I don't know. I don't think we'll get crushed in any way in this one, but I think we'll be just fine. And the Blood Asp, with the, it's got the LRM loadout as well. Um, hmm. I gotta remember too, we need enough for a second Lance to run the second mission. We'll have the Orion, well, the, the Marauder will be back too. So, you know what, let's do this. Let's wait for the Marauder to come back. We've got lots of days here. Let's actually bring the Orion and the Marauder back into play. Maybe we bring the Orion into battle just to see how it goes. Um, no, nah, we don't play. You guys enjoy. Okay, so let's see how this does. I mean, we got we got enough C bills for this. Let's bring in the Ryan. All right, thank you, thank you very much. Okay, but uh, war criminal, negotiate, full salvage, accept, and we're gonna bring in. Um, so the Marauders back, excellent, and let's bring in uh, Hot Dam and Megasaur. I'm gonna leave the archer out. That can go for the second lance, and let's bring in the Orion. What does that leave us? The Defiance, right, with the Rotary Five, the Grasshopper, which we don't need to run, um, the Hellbringer with the, the SRM variant. Yeah, that's probably good enough for the other mission. So we're gonna take this lance. And let's just see how it goes. All right, here we go, guys. All right, there's our target. We got flankers left, right. Um, Time to get paid. Yeah. Commander, 
I think we're gonna go this way. I'm really hoping we got enough ammo for this. Keep your eyes peeled, Commander. This looks like an ideal place for an ambush. Every place is an ideal place for an ambush. You know what you're doing. I'm receiving you. I'm there. Okay, we got lots of enough ER peeps here and some ultras and stuff, so hoping to pull these guys down fast. Okay, Thunderbolt. Barbarian. See what our chance to hit here is. 50, that's not bad. Two damage, four damage on the Thunderbolts. Two Thunderbolts, eh? Um. We've got Swarm too, right? We could, yeah, I think we dropped some Swarm. A little less chance to hit, but... I can hit two guys anyway. I think they know we're here. So we're gonna move up. Roger. Take advantage of this. Let's hammer this guy up. Um, I'm gonna leave it on three shots. Yeah, it's fire on this guy again. Target locked. Okay. Critical hit, Commander. Yeah, baby. Yes, Commander. And hey, let's get you in here. No shooting. Just run. Oh no, no, we got shooting too. Look at that. Look at those chances to hit. That's awesome. So we've also got uh, Thunder improved incendiary. Uh, so it's like uh, incendiary minefields. Um. But let's fire normal. Ah, uh, not bad. I mean, it's no double rack, Orion, that's for sure. Okay, this is going to be a long, hard fight. What do we got over here? Catafract. No, catapult. Hunchback, probably, with LRM5s. Jager Mac. Okay, we got to kill this guy. Stalker, Antos, Jaeger, I have no idea. Alright, let's get this Barbarian's leg removed. Full First thing we want to do, what else we got here? Ignis, alright. First thing we're going to do though is shoot this guy. Yeah, man. I think our other boys here should be able to easily take the legs, or girls, sorry, take the legs off this Barbarian. Oh, he's moving into range. Order. Um, I got a legging job for you here. I think you can engage this guy over here. Um, let's not make ourselves visible to those guys. Location let's just get in here. Not the optimal position, but pretty darn good. Let's try and pull this guy's leg off. Oh yeah. Inflicted some heavy damage. You sure as hell did. K 
Okay, maybe we can pull out the other leg and then that will be, maybe we can leave that to hot dam and see if she can get in there to do it. Um, let's get into this position. Yeah, pretty good chances to hit. We're going to warlord it. Offensive push. Oh, well, we don't need to do offensive push because he's lying on the ground. Don't waste it. All right, firing. Nope, not enough. Not enough. Megasaur is going to have to finish it off. How did we do, though? God, got the torso. I guess we could kill him by going torso. Mm hmm. Ready for orders. Understood. Moving fast. Leg or torso? This is 83. 100 and something. Let's go after the torso. Come on, guys, decide what you're doing. Damage yeah, we're just going to keep focus firing on this one side, I think. One guy at a time, kill him one at a time, rather than splitting it up. The Thunderbolt should go down relatively fast. But I think this catapult really needs to be the one that goes next. My armor's getting stripped off. It is. Yes, Commander. On my way. That's pretty good. Let's do this. Uh, I'm gonna leave it at three. Okay. Now let's see if we can finish this guy up. Swarm again. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna warlord it yet. Ooh, how much has he got left here? A hundred. So this should be enough, I think. Yeah, plenty. Enemy destroyed. Now we can just finish up the uh, Barbarian on the ground this turn. And then the Catapult is next turn. What's up, boss? I want you to come this way, please. And let's use your splashy weapons mostly here. Okay. Not so bad. Commander? Okay, so let's move over. I want to get closer or not. Uh, I don't think so. You know what? Let's just fire on this guy. Straight out. Just fire. And then we'll back up to here. Ten four. Just for now. Ah, it's awesome. These are AMSs, man. They look awesome. Well, 
Thank goodness for that guy's lack of targeting. Yeah, all right, move it in. That's fine. We all good with that. So summertime's in full swing up here in Canada, and my attic is roasting. I got both my windows open. I got a fan here that I turn on between episodes just to cool off a bit. But um, with the mic I currently have, it's uh, it's an Omni mic, which means it picks up sound from all around, which is why you hear you know my family downstairs, a little bit of my fan from my computer, you know any other noises that are going on from outside. But uh, I got to get a new mic, so I will be doing that very shortly, hopefully. Hopefully this summer I'll probably pick one up. But anyway, um, yeah, so I can't run my fan or my AC or else you guys would be hearing that too. Receiving. So uh, once I'm able to uh, get a new mic here, it won't be so hot. I'm sweating my butt, my butt off up here right now. Uh, let's just hammer this guy because he's being a nuisance. So let's be a nuisance right back. Whoa. Girl, that hit something good. she's reminding me a lot of Mockingbird now. Oh, <laughs> a little present for you, buddy. Yeah. All right, Megasaur. Let's. I flipped the camera around by accident here. Here we go. Where are you? Right here. Um, we can get a side shot in from here. I think I want to do that. What side are we on here? So that's the side I think he's got his PPC on. So, um, offensive push is pretty good. Let's, uh, 25% for a headshot. Let's go after the headshot. We got lots of shots here, so let's see what we got. I think we destroyed his head. One less target. See ya. Yes, Commander. Uh, can we get... How do I want to fight these guys now? Probably back this way. So I'm going to sprint you back here, probably. Moving at full throttle. You're going to lead the charge. Keep them pinned down while we come around the corner. Let's back up. I want to get my stability back, so we're not going to sprint. Let's get over here. What do we got again? Ignis SRM. I don't want feel like getting some heat on me, so uh, let's LK this guy. And yep. I like them apples. A little better with direct fire, I think. Yipper. Let's hammer him. Uh, you got 162. A lot less than the turret. Let's OP the turret. Here it comes. Nope. God. It's a good thing we offensive pushed the turret and like did damage everywhere else. But you know what? Uh, yeah, that's right. I remember correctly now. The um, LRMs, they, uh, they only target... The uh, offensive push only targets the first location. And everything else follows. Uh, let's take a shortcut. Uh, what do we got here again? The Jaeger mech. Oh. <sighs> That's a juicy target. Let's take it. The Agramex notoriously yeah. don't have a whole lot of armor. Let's get into here. Um, we can't multi. We gotta just choose a target. So let's just choose this guy. I'm gonna turn the normal off. I'm just gonna fire this. 
Nice. I was concerned there for a second we weren't going to kill him. Hot damn. Hot damn. Yeah, you better back the fuck up. You know what's good for you. Oh, let's see if we can heat this guy. So we got... Let's get into here. And let's go after this guy. And we're going to use a Thunder Incendiary and hammer him. And if he moves, he'll take even more heat. Uh, our rack's down, but I knew that would happen. Let's move over here. Um, on Toast Mark IV, I, I think we better hit this guy. Uh, I'm not going to Warlord next turn. Once we get the rack up, I'll Warlord hit that guy. It's a Scarecrow, eh? Main guy, I think, is a Scarecrow. Okay, we're going to switch this around. Let's drop some thunder on him. Here it comes, Bubba. Have fun walking out of there. Have fun walking out of that. Ah, he's running away. Commander? I was going to finish him up too, the little bastard. Move order received. Uh, let's Warlord this and offensive push. And let's see if we can't claim a leg here, maybe. Copy that, Commander. Should be going down, though. That yep, confirmed. going down. God, the lava effects are so awesome. Come on, move. Let's see what happens to your legs. Come on. Huh. Ready for order. Whole lot of nothing, I guess, eh? Well. Acknowledged. You want thunder? Uh, yeah. Thundar. Yeah, I, I don't know if he's alive anymore. If he is, he's, his ass is on the ground, that's for sure. For Didn't say it was a kill, though. Ooh. Roger. <laughs> Spinning up the rack. Um, yeah, let's just fire. Confirmed. Totally worth it. Yes, you won't fire anything next turn. That's fine. Just cool off. You got to cool it down. Cool it down. Before you shut down. Did you, uh... Oh, I guess because we warlorded, we'd, lo we did, we'd lost a whole bunch of heat. Cool. You're liking that mech a little bit too much, I think. Um... You want thunder? He has to come this way to escape anyway. 
think the escape zone is like over here. I really, really hope he doesn't try to go away after this, but let's drop some uh, thunder on him. Left. Vehicle down. Shit, where'd he go? What's up, boss? Double time, let's go. Got nothing on sensors. There he is. Say hello to my little friends. Well, there you go. Let's go home. Okay, contract payment increased by 35%. This should more than cover our uh, damages here. Come on. All right, catapult parts, barbarian part, stalker parts. Which the nice of that would be thunderbolt parts, lots of them. Um, I'd like to find. Let's go all the way down to the bottom. I want to see if they have any prototype double heat sinks, double plus heat bank. We've got already. Fire control systems we have. Double heat sinks we got lots of. Spike leg boots. Yeah. Got two of these already. Double heat sink kit we could take for sea bills, but we got lots. So heat dissipating armor, we just used up our last one. Let's grab that. Uh, a lot of Artemis fire control systems, eh? Um Hmm. Yeah, we got plenty of this other stuff, so I'm gonna grab two Thunderbolt parts. We might get lucky and get enough. All right, let's confirm this. Nope. Yeah, scarce mech parts. You are medium laser clan, okay. Yeah, a bunch of other junk. All right, let's have a look here. Ah, 114,000, that's not too bad for repairs. 17 days, it'll be a lot less than that though. Let's have a look here. Uh, let's manage our tasks a bit. Uh, let's get the Marauder up. Wow, Marauder took some good hits, I guess, eh? Um, Orion, we want in for sure, but I guess it doesn't really matter. Blood Ass will be back in five days. When is our financial report? Seven, so they'll be back. That's no problem. Okay, so let's run the second mission here. Let's have a look here. Um, contracts. Biological sample. Let's negotiate this. We lost some rep with these guys. We're about to, but about to get it back plus some. Okay, flush this guys out. These gals out. That is the ladies. Satori's coming in. Uh, we got Chupacabra, uh, Speed of Sound Sonic, and Diva. Let's go with these guys, and we're gonna run the. Who do I want to give? Let's give the Defiance to uh, Satori. Uh, we're leaving the Grasshopper out. Let's give Chupacabra that one. Hellbringer and then Diva can have her Diva ways in the Archer. And I think that's probably good. So let's run this and see how we do. Alright, let's do this. Recovering Korean operatives carrying biological sample cases. Alright. We can do this. Do you really? Lots of snow on your planet, huh? 
This is not snow. You want to see snow? I show you snow. Hey. Come to Winterpeg in winter time. You say so. Ready for orders. Hydra doesn't quite have the speed, but does not need to have it. Nothing. Okay. I want to climb this hill fast. Nobody's fast. The speed of sound. Sonic! Nothing. So I've been formulating how we're going to run this next... Uh, ooh, Mad Cat 3X, eh? Oh. Oh, there's a second... Right, we got to pick up the biological samples from over here. we got two lances. Right. Hover transport, okay. Oh, you're just gonna make me angry. I'm okay. For now. What's up, boss? For now. Roger. Now we don't have a lot of ammo. Catapult, eh? Um, ten percent, eh? Eighty percent in the catapult, really? Well, we'll take that. Waiting on you, Commander. It's raining lerms. Hallelujah, it's raining lerms. Demolisher, okay. Alright. Somebody needs a face full of serms. Another catapult. Alright, this should be a good match. By. That's the guy we hit. Another catapult. A griffin. That's the demolisher. He's got a pair of AC-20s, eh? But, much harder chance to hit, though. 38%. Why is it such... That's interesting. ELRMs, PPC, ELRMs, enhanced LRMs, BSPLs. Um... 51%. Let's take that. Max out the damage while we can at range. We're going to sweep down here and take these guys first. We'll hit up that demolisher as soon as he gets up, up invisible. Yeah, they don't got the juice. Don't worry about it. A pair of 15s ain't going to do nothing to us. Come on. Grab the operatives first, man. Grab the data second. Save the people. Oh, oh, we're gonna wait a long time. Oh. Well, there's our first victim, it looks like. Reporting minimal damage. And a specter. Okay. Not so bad. I just don't know what's on the other side over there. We got a Mad Cat 3X over there. The hover transport demolisher and something. So I got this cranked almost to maximum difficulty. So I, I think the fights have been slightly tougher. Not, not ridiculously tougher, but slightly tougher. Uh, this guy definitely needs a face full of SRMs, but how are we going to how are we going to hand them to him? That's the question. 
26. Let's just come over here. I know it's not as good. It's not as good, but we're just going to shoot from here for now. Want to make sure we stay together. Oh, that's some good st instability, though. Standing by. Let's make this guy completely unstable. Uh, yeah, let's use the Artemis. Let's see how you like it. Getting there. Getting there. We'll let Diva go first, make him unstable, and then we'll let Satori hit him. Maybe we get lucky with a headshot, or we go after, I don't know, a leg or something. Let the, uh, that's the Mad Cat 3X. Thanks for showing up. So we have, uh, in Hamilton, we've got the, uh, um, Warplane Heritage Museum. Every once in a while I get to see the B-25 and the Lancaster bombers flying around. It's pretty cool. I just mentioned it because I just heard a single engine fighter fly over as we were um, as we were loading in for the match here. You can always tell just by the sound of the engines what it is. So whether it's a fighter or the bombers. All right. Good to go. Coordinates received. Let's give this guy some pain with the rotary warlord attack. Um. There we go. Now, do we offensive push him? That's the question. How much has he got? We're gonna overheat, eh? Um. Really low chance to hit the head. We could just go after the CT. Um, yeah, sure, why not? Let's just see what we can do with the CT here. Engine destroyed, and we get a knockdown, but he still gets to go, so... How badly damages he though? Oh yeah, <laughs> he's a pot shot away from being killed. One good SRM volley and he's done. Okay, so their mobility with the exception of the Spectre has been targeted. You better jump away, buddy. Jump away to live another day. He's going to jump over here, I bet you. Either here, or he's going to jump back here. One of the two. See what he does. After he spends time calculating what he's going to do. Come on, buddy. It's not a math problem. See if I'm right. Oh, he's going for the back shot. Bad move, dude. Yeah. He just committed suicide, but whatever. Whatever. Especially staying facing like that. At least face this way or something. Ah, we took a little bit of damage to the back. Yeah, nice light show. Nice, nice light show there, buddy. I hear ya. How do we want to do this now? Could just push this guy. Nope, can't do that. I think we could... Well, that's probably better. Got it. He's all yours. Uh -huh. 
Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Yes, Commander. It's just crazy. Where's the demolisher? There he is. So these guys are going to B. And everything else to A. Let's see if we can make sure we kill this guy. If we can hit him. Hit the CT. My god. You just need one CT hit. What is up? Are you guys just afraid to kill him? It's a raven. Okay. They're just afraid to kill him. That's what it is. They're like, I don't know, man. Doesn't seem right. Doesn't seem right killing okay. him like that. There. Okay. Uh, we went through the fire, so uh, let's drop. Let's drop two. Fire the rest. Okay. See, that's how it's done. Thank you. Thank you very much. So the catapults are trying to flank, which is a mistake because we're going to come down. We're going to sweep down on them now. The Spectre will be a target of opportunity. Meaning if we can't target the catapults, we'll target the Spectre. Uh-huh. Forty-four, huh? What about that uh, demolisher? He's so far away, too. Like, oh, we can't even see him now. All right, well, we know who we're shooting for. Oh, we penetrated somewhere. Probably his arm. Come on, guys. Wind it up. Let's go. Yeah, so they had a B-17 up here last year. Planning on having it up again this year. I don't know if it's going to be the Canada, Canada Day weekend this next weekend. Um, or when it is. But uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing that thing flying through the sky. Got a chance to go up in it last year. That was kind of cool. I don't know, man. Those guys that were flying in those things. Just walking through with the bomb bay doors open. On the gangplanks, I, I could just imagine having to look down at the ground below you. It's panicking every time I walk down that bomber, uh, wa the bomb walkway there, between the two bomb bay doors, and just, uh, just I just had panic attacks, thinking, man, if I, if I had to be up in this thing, and I had to walk through there, that's just crazy. But I gotta say, it was pretty cool. Pretty cool being in that thing. Yeah, I know I'm on rough ground. I know I'm on rough ground. But we want to take advantage of this guy while we can. Oh. That was lousy. But we flushed him out, which is a good thing. Ready for order. Affirmative. Um. Do we we have swarm right? Yeah. Time for the warlord. Warlord swarm fire. Nice. I think he'll be gone by the end of this turn. We still got the Archer and we got Speed of Sound Sonic with the SRMs. She's going to speed up over there and uh, hopefully hit him with some dead fire. And if we can see the Demolisher, I might rain down the Archer's missiles on the Demolisher. So 
something terrible like speed of sound. Sonic, here she comes. Um, Dead fire's got 32%. Let's save it till we can get close. Let's just fire this. Nope. You're gonna be taking all all the lerms. Enjoy the lerms at point blank range. See ya. Well, we all know we can do it. Just a matter of how long it's going to take us. That's the question. It's not a matter of when you can, or if you can do it. It's a matter of how long it's going to take. It's not an interesting uh, conversation with the person. It's really like a, uh, you know, high-end thinker, and he was like, you know, school is like, everyone asks them to each other when you're getting out of school, hey, what'd you get? What'd you get in your class, right? And he's like, really, it should be, how long did it take? How long did it take you to learn that subject, right? You got some people that can learn it really quickly, other people it takes a little, a little while longer, but wouldn't you want to be going to a doctor who actually learned everything? And it took him an extra couple of years? Or would you rather be going to a doctor that's just like... Oh, there you are. Oh, you're in a bad position, buddy. Who is like, yeah, I got, you know, 84%. I'd rather go to a brain surgeon that <laughs> had, like... Took him a little while longer. Let's just do that. But learned everything. Did we just kill that guy? We didn't. Oh, we hit two two different torsos, though. Ah, so close, yet so far. Anyway, it was an interesting conversation. But then I said, you know, some people just will never make it out of school. And it's like, well, not that they won't make it out of school. You get a good idea of what they'll be able to do, though. Right? Order. Would you rather go to the brain surgeon that got 75% or the brain surgeon that learned everything? That's all. That's all. Uh, yeah, let's just kill this guy. Caught you out of position. Somebody had their pants down. There's that demolisher. Now, can we get in to see that guy? We cannot. We can. Before we do it, though, Let's make sure we vigilance this shit out of this. Going as fast as I can. You are, and you're totally amazing. 26%, huh? Okay, good start. Good start. Waiting for orders. Can we clap that up, people? Can we clap that up for the good start? Moving out. Clap it up for the good start, please. Oh, we don't. We only have Artemis. That's right. Uh, how do we do for the front? That's not bad. Maybe we get lucky here. Not today. Pretty damn close, though. Speed of sound sonic should easily be able to finish that up. We'll send um, Chupacabra down to grab the uh, grab the operatives. Once the demolisher is gone, they don't really have any serious opposition, so it's not a big deal. Come on, figure out where you're going. It's getting hard sitting in this heat here, guys. Come on. Now I know what it was. Th now I know what those mech pilots feel like sitting in the cockpits when they're overheating. Oh, you cheeky monkey! Sorry guys, but I can't let that pass. Moving to position. Cannot let that pass. You want to be a smart ass? Okay. 
Ah, I was hoping to kill him. Good to go. Yeah, we can't even get down there. But we can kill the demolisher though, that's good. So we're gonna do Still multi. Let's fire on you. Let's fire on you. This is gonna be Artemis on B. And fire. Firing on multiple oh, you useless really? I'm such an idiot. On my way. I'm such an idiot. But that's how I like to live my life. No problem. I've got enough guns Ooh, for everyone. Nice shot. There we go. That's how it's done. That's how it's done. for a smudge. Should really reconsider his career choice. That's all I gotta say. That's somebody who walked out of this out of class saying, hey I got a 73. Not yeah I mastered uh, the uh, skill of piloting a Spectre. can see this guy. Let's leave the lerms off for the rest. Not really doing very well with those lasers. Alright, firing. Wow. Really? Come on, guys. All I see is repair bill. That's all I'm seeing right now, guys. Just seeing repair bill. That's good enough for me. That looks like a critical hit. Yeah, but it should have looked like a kill. Should have looked like a kill. We shall. Everybody comes home today. He says, and then gets one of his mech warriors head shot off. Two mechs left. Two mechs and our biological samples. The secondary asset is under fire, Commander. <sighs> is it? Really? Because I didn't know that. I didn't know that they're actually trying to defend the secondary asset. I just figured they were going to let us take it and that would be the end of it. But, you know, I am just an experienced commander that's been in battle for like, what, 200, or sorry, 2,800 and some odd days. Yeah, it's shocking. Both the series, I, I, had a, I had a quick look how many days they're in. They're both in the 2,800 range. 2,800 days. Raven, 32, 29. Let's go for the Raven. OK, 
Okay. Waiting for orders. Let's just learn this guy. Let's learn a let's let's learn him a lesson. I wonder if he's learning his lesson. Ha 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 ha. Uh, I need you to get the hell up there. Okay. And let's leave that for now. Hey. What do you think? You think you want to kill somebody? I think you do. Oh boy, here we go. Oh boy, here we go. Acid. Let's put one. A let's put two acid and the rest uh, LK. Got a little bit of both. Little bit of both. That should help the LRMs out. Completely forgot we were carrying acid. I should have been using it from the beginning. But no big deal. We'll use it now. Thanks for showing up, buddy. Appreciate the time. Appreciate the time. Waiting for orders. I read you, Commander. Moving out. Rotary auto cannon for the win. Here we go. Waiting for orders. Diva. Okay. Let's drop some lerms on this guy's ass. Alright, we got three turns of LRMs left for that guy. So uh, let's Warlord this. And we're going to change this to Swarm. And we're going to go after this guy. On it. I have no idea if we hit the Raven or not. Target's taken a critical hit. Could not see because the camera zoomed in. No idea. We may have. All right, what are they doing? I was hoping this mission was going to go quicker. Maybe we could take another one today, but moving kind of slow. Leading me just a little too much there. Let's push these guys. Let's push them. Hmm. I think we're going to go this route. Nicely done. Nicely done. That's fine. I need you to move in and get those biological samples. Oh, you still got LK ammo anyway. I don't know why you're worried. Don't know why you're worried. Yep. Yeah, at least he's making a, a proper stand. Right, that's when you want to do get the high ground. Get between the target and yourself, or the target and the enemy, that is. You know what I mean. When I shoot you, you'll See ya. Oh, he's taking it, but I don't think he likes it very much. This would be beautiful if there was, like, one more lance that would show up. Enemy reinforcements have arrived. Yay! Waiting for orders. Just for that little bit more fighting. Double time. Let's go. That should be it. You know what? There's a, an idea for difficulty setting. Oh, no. Right? You can, well, I can't get down that way? I'll try. You can set it up so that every mission's got a reinf uh, reinforcement lance. So in one difficulty setting, it would just be like, Going full throttle. 
once 50% of the defending force has been destroyed, another land shows up. Kind of like on, um, on, uh, what do you call it, um, ambush convoy missions. Once half the convoy is destroyed, if they're going to have reinforcements, then they show up. Which is why it's always good to kill the convoy guards first. She's moving fast like speed of sound. Sonic! You say so. Commander. Yeah, we'll hold for the sample. What's up, Samples uh, the Z. Full speed. No there it is, folks. Alright, contract payment increased by 30%. We're going to be paying more than that out, though. We'll be paying more than that out. That wasn't too bad of a fight. It could have been much better, but it wasn't too bad. Uh, Mad Cat X parts, Raven. Uh, I think I'll let the chips fall where they may. LRM 20 clan. We've only got one of these, don't we? That's a possibility. Um, fire control system Artemis clan. Feral Lamellar. Let's take that. Watchdog Sweet Clan, plus one defense. This is only one and a half tons. We'll take that. Yeah, man. LRM doubles we don't need. Okay, so let's grab a couple catapult parts. Well, Mad Cat Axe is kind of nice. But we encounter catapults so many, so much more often. It's more likely that we'll get uh, this than anything. All right, couple catapult parts, my cat X parks, Raven Specter part. Oh, we're close to getting a final, a new Specter there. Here, are micro laser, Beagle probe, IC engine. Well, some stuff to sell, some stuff to keep. All right, let's see what we got here. Yeah, one hundred sixty-three thousand. No big deal though. We got tons of stuff we can sell. Lots of stuff that we can sell. All right, no catapult, but no big deal. Let's change this around a little bit here. So, what do we want up earlier? Are we going to... Let's just have a look at the contracts here first. Do we want to take another mission here? Three and a half skulls. Uh, two lances of maximum dropping. Uh, that might be a that might be a night, miss, night mission to uh, keep and a repost mission. So, maybe we do stay here. So, let's figure out then. Um, Argo... Manage our tasks. Who do we want up first? So two lances of mechs. Let's bring the Blood Asp up. We'll bring the main lance into play first. The Cataphract can come up. Let's get the Marauder to the top. Orion can come up. 3-3-2-2. Three, three, two, two. So five days. These guys will all be back. And these two will be both in. Yeah, and then Marauder will be back before these guys. Okay, so that's not that's actually not bad. We're going to go this route, I think. All right, but we're going to leave the episode there, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, the uh, Night Witches are not dead. We're still going to be uh, recording episodes. But like I said, once we get, uh, and it's close right now, the uh, Jade Falcon Freeborn up to the same number, uh, episode number as Night Witches. Uh, then I'm going to go back and forth between the two, but right now I'm just kind of doing a couple of uh, Jade Falcon Freeboard and then One Night Witches, just so they can get up in sync. Because when I end the series, I want to have them kind of both at the same number. And then the last episode, we're going to do like a little uh, um, recap to see, you know, who has the most number of kills. And we can probably compare the two series just to see um, who the best pilots were, things like that. We can uh, honor our dead. We've got a few dead this season. Um, we didn't have before, but we do now. Um, it's been a while since we lost a pilot, and I should probably knock on wood so that we don't lose one. But, um, yeah. So, yeah, anyway, I'm going to leave the episode there. hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please be free to subscribe, and you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.